Welcome to Maps IPV Tips. Today we are going to talk about whether the VTS can function properly under non-standard voltage conditions. Our flight controller has HD and analog versions, but the analog version doesn't have a stable 10 volts power supply. When we use VTS that requires 10 volts, it can't get the necessary voltage. In such cases, if we power it with 5 volts, the VTS can still work. However, due to the lower voltage, its power output doesn't reach its rated capacity. For example, it's rated for 500 watts and might only reduce around 100 watts. In reality, this may have problems when flying over longer distance, as insufficient power might lead to signal loss and video dropout. Therefore, it's very important to match your VTX with suitable flight controller and ensure the VTX operates with its rated voltage. Hopefully, this video can help you out technically. Go ahead, like, and subscribe. We'll see you next time. Maps.